In this video, I'm going to show you how to measure the limb in order to determine what size cuff to use. So as a guide on the BFR worksheet, if you print that out, it'll show you what size correlates to the cuff size. But even if we don't have a tape measure, I'll show you how to easily know what size cuff to use. So I'm going to pull in my trusty partner, Copper. Come on in here. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is look for a couple landmarks. My first landmark is going to be the deltoid tubercle. So where the deltoid comes in, you'll see this nice V on her, and it comes right to that point. That's my first landmark. My second landmark for the lower extremity is going to be the greater trochanter of the femur. So if we're going to take a measurement for the upper extremity, I'm going to take my tape measure, I'm going to wrap it around, and I'm going to let you relax. I'm going to loosely determine what the size is, and it's 11 inches. So then, on my worksheet, I'll look and I'll write down right arm circumference is 11 inches. The cuff size that correlates with that is limb size 6 to 11, which is cuff size number one. Now what you'll notice is that 11 inches is included in cuff size one, but it's also included in the lower end of cuff size two. So we're normally going to use the smaller cuff as long as it fully in circles around the limb. So now to go to the lower extremity, I'm going to come below and measure right below the greater trochanter. If I can't identify where that is, I'll just have you point your toe into the ground and twist your limb in and out. So just kind of, yep, move it back and forth. And I can feel that greater trochanter move. That gives me my landmark. You can relax. And now I'm going to wrap and I'll notice here it's 22 inches. So I go to this, I write down 22 inches. I go down below and I see that cuff size 16 to 22 is a cuff size three or it's a cuff size four. So I'm gonna use the smaller cuff as long as that it fully encircles around the cuff and I'll show you how to do that in the next video.